I've been I've been doing suit stuff for years, for a lot of years, a lot of years, um, probably uh, probably ten years, and I've done a lot of characters, a lot of different roles, roles, um, act, actors' roles, acting, yeah, acting, because I'm an actor when I'm in the suit. I'm playing. Did you see Alien, Alien Three, or Alien Resurrection? You you've seen you've seen uh, the movies, the the uh, cinema cinema movies cinema movies of monsters of uh, uh, Alien uh, Alien Three and Alien Resurrection on the. Uh, movie screen you've seen yes S yes me me monster on screen on movie screen me monster uh, alien uh, 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 uh. this is my third time as the alien you think I'd be really bored but I kind of keep it interesting for myself I was Try to come up with some new, you know, some new angle to play the, uh, to play the alien from, because it's like it's like an actor's role. It's like an acting thing. I don't know. If, I don't know if you've ever done acting, but it's uh, it's different from uh, it's just different from from normal thinking. You have to come up with uh, uh, internal internal stuff. I've done so many roles. I've done so many roles over the last few years. A bunch of different characters. Jumanji, Jumanji, Lion. And Jumanji Crocodile. So it's like two, uh, two for the price of one kind of thing. Uh, uh, Evolution. I played uh, uh, this blue alien ape-like creature. No way. That's that's pumpkinhead. Evolution. Uh, So I said Jumanji, right? Um, oh, I also did uh, X Files movie. He seems benign, but he's really um, a bad alien. Uh, did you see Mortal Kombat? Uh, with Goro, the forearmed, the big forearmed character. Pumpkin head. Pumpkin head. You should come visit our shop in L LA, Los Angeles, in California, because we have on the wall, we have a lot of the uh, heads, masks, masks that I wear, and you could see all of the characters. You could see all of the roles I've been playing over the years. It's really it's very interesting. It would be very interesting for you to see that. Alishka is to trans to translate Alishka Alishko that's a check not here This one, it's diamond forged. Yeah, so even starting off first thing in the morning, like like I usually start off with a good hot shower, kind of opens up the capillaries. You know, you step into the shower as Tom Woodruff, but I step out as the alien because I'm already I'm already primed as the alien. I'll start. Well, I'm not in the suit, but in here, in here, that's where the alien starts. <laughs> Like a lot of actors, because a lot of it's, a lot of, it's, a lot of it's prep work. 
as an actor, just kind of prepping, getting into the character. I had to wear, uh, I had to wear contact lenses in uh, Scary Movie 3. We did a, an incredible Hulk uh, character. Of course, it's, the, it's the role that no one will see because it got cut out. It's now on the editing room floor somewhere. For a moment there, I thought I could hear Tom's voice. <laughs> They were, uh, Good. they were like these. They were, uh, they were the, uh, full, uh, the full lenses. They're uncomfortable, aren't they? They're hard. They make it really hard to do your job. <laughs> <laughs> like, I used to use the suit. I used to get into the suit when I'd get into the character, but now I like to get into it a little bit earlier. Like, like just from the very beginning of the day. I don't want to wait till... I don't wait till my uh, call time to come in and then start working on it. I think it's really important. A lot of people put down the, uh, the suit. It's, really, it's, it makes a difference between uh, between the character working and not working. I think is internally because that's what acting is. It's about being a character, not pretending to be a character. So if I'm in the suit, I'm not just a guy in a suit. I am the alien. Like in Alien 3 or Alien Resurrection, or I'm a different, like, uh, like Evolution. I was, I was one of those blue apes, but it wasn't just like a guy in a suit being a blue ape. Being, it was really being a blue ape, but breathing all the time. And this is the, uh, this is the easy way. Pushing buttons and making a making a puppet work is uh, inside a suit. I feel like uh, I guess I'm the button pusher. Pushing buttons, just being an actor. And, uh, Jumanji. When I was in the lion suit, that was uh, that was a bear. <laughs> to be in the lion suit, and uh, I felt like I was I'm just pushing my own buttons because I'm I'm acting inside the lion suit. It's a lot of work, but the rewards, the rewards are worth it. If you could just do like a little once over, make sure there's no little like uh, flaky bits in there, because because uh, like a lot of times when I'm wearing suits, because I do it so much, I guess maybe maybe I'm more sensitive to it, or maybe I'm just more uh, more experienced or something more knowledgeable. But it's just stuff gets in right, right around your eye, you know. You're trying to look, and, and for me, it's acting. It's an acting thing. Like Pumpkinhead, I was this demon character, and you have to you have to be a demon, be kind of demonic. You can't be just yourself anymore. Um, and that's the difference between just just wearing a suit and being an actor. And I I like to think of myself as an actor when I'm in these things. It helps members in the audience. Hey, do you want this tool over there? I can't. I can't concentrate on my thing, my acting thing, if I've got those little things always. My eyes, I can't see. I mean, I can see, but it's just, it, it's just in the way. So, yeah, just, if it wants over, maybe. But a lot of you guys just don't realize, right, what it's like to be in a suit. I've been there a lot of times. A lot of suits, a lot of years. Tom! Tom! Will you shut the fuck up? <laughs>